how 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 would you describe you know when when you kind of you first have the idea pitched and it was all very well you're going to be this you know blue guy or whatever but but for you what is the essence of a blue meanie character like whenever you think back in your career like how would you describe your character uh, when i first started i was almost a lot you know i was almost exactly that character from the movie but <clears throat> as we start moving on and uh doing parodies you know growing up you know i was a huge fan of wrestling but i was also a huge fan of stand-up comedy and a whole bunch of different things and um more of myself started coming out in the character you know what you know once we start doing you know blue dust uh baron von stevie colonel demini the blue meanie bloods you know uh, uh i was sir meanie and lord stevie uh just and i could just be that you know i could bring in my other influences from like comedy you know i grew up a huge fan of george carlin and if you ever seen a george carlin stand up that you know he's always doing faces like you know yeah. i know this is a podcast but you know he, he's big on the facials and stuff like that and I would work that in my routine, you know, the blue meanie face, you know, the, that, that's a, that's a tribute to my, uh, my grandfather, you know, uh, I remember being a kid in my, in my crib, looking up and my grandfather looking at me, looking down me and, you know, going, you know, making faces like that. And somewhere I, I posted, I found a photo of us both doing the face as when I was a kid, but I incorporated that into my character. So the character of the blue meanie is just basically a fun, loving mischief mischievous character but uh when it comes to uh, when it comes time to be serious he could be serious you know uh i'll come to the ring i'll do the meanie dance this that, and the other thing but once the heel starts doing things uh heelish i'll reply in kind to whatever the heel's doing and then you know you know uh take it a little bit serious but it's it the character's always just been i'd like to say i'm i'm in Philly, we got a uh, sports, we got sports mask, sports mascots, like the Philly fanatic or gritty. I'd like to think I am the pro wrestling equivalent of gritty or the Philly fanatic, you know, you know, other guys were doing all these crazy things and, you know, sacrificing their, their bodies, you know, Paul and Raven would have us go out there and do something to lighten the mood mm. in order to, you know, people people will be right here from like whatever was going on. All right, here comes something to make you laugh to get your mind all, you know, in a different mood. So when the next thing happens, you're not burnt out. 